Stop it! Stop it, for God's sake! You flatter me too much, madam. Uh, I want to give you a little tip before we go on with the show. I was at a party last week. Quite an eclectic party, lots of interesting people. I don't know why I was pointing at you there. So how would you know what eclectic means? <laughs> lots of interesting people. Did you know what eclectic means? Not a clue. Not a clue. Well, there you go. I picked out the right fucking guy. Right. <laughs> Where are you from? Montreal. Montreal as well. Right. Is there any American people in, by the way? I should have asked. Oh, hello. How are you doing? You all right? Just one. <laughs> and not, he was too afraid to even say it. Did you see that? He just went, oh, I was just scratching my thing. <laughs> I was in LA actually uh, just before I came here. It's a weird thing they do there. They've got this. Everything's everything's oh my god, right? In 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 in, in LA. <laughs> oh my god! 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 So they, 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 I've, I've watched women have entire conversations where oh my god was just said in different intonations. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, 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 oh my god! Oh my god! Do you know the ones? Do you know the ones I really hate? The ones that do it really quickly. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. That evidently that means I've got something exciting to say, right? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, listen, oh my god, oh my god. Which is interesting. I'll tell you why, because when we see a Muslim person going, Allah, 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 which is, oh my God, that is the literal translation. Yeah? We don't go, oh look, Muhammad has something exciting to say, do we? No. We're like, fuck, get off the bus, right? But just a same phrase, different country, totally different reaction. Oh my God. Anyway, I was at this party and there was a lot of interesting people there. And one of them was a famous Bollywood director, right? I was quite excited by this. I've never met a famous Bollywood director before. So I went up to him and said, can I ask you a question about Bollywood? He was immediately offended. Do you know why? Bollywood is sort of a Western term for Indian cinema, but Indian people call it Indian cinema. Bollywood's actually quite an offensive term to use. I didn't know that. Did you know I didn't know this? I said, look, I'm really sorry. He explained it to me. I said, look, I'm really sorry. I didn't mean to offend you. He said, it's OK, just don't use that term again. I said, I promise I won't. He said, what was your question? I said, all right, um, why is Indian cinema <laughs> shit? <laughs> and that was pretty much the end of that conversation when I think about it now. I went to visit your uh, Notre Dame th uh, church today, right? Eh? Oh, but, oh, sorry. <laughs> Fucking hell. I, was, I didn't know I was getting footnotes on this performance, but thank you. I think you'll find it's Basilica, Danny. I'm literally just writing it down. <laughs> oh, my God, he said church. Basilica, well, Basilica church, what's the difference? Basilica is an Oh, she knows it. She knows the difference. <laughs> rhetorical jest and she was like well if you want to know Danny take a seat monkey boy I'll tell you everything you need to fucking know <laughs> what is the difference quickly <laughs> I'm asking her to paraphrase 2,000 years of history <laughs> quickly come on what's the story he, he, he lived he died eh? he got in a cave right come on quick I'm bored I'll be honest with you <laughs> You know how, like, in romantic films, they said, you had me at hello, you lost me at a basilica. <laughs> you lost me at a basilica. <laughs> anyway, very, very... I'm sorry, you, you know, that's, that's terrible. <laughs> You're educated and I've just made... And I'm the fool, I should not, for not knowing that. But, I, but the thing is, it was in this, uh, the basilica. You see, this, the great thing about this is, they will edit this, so I just said that. We, wouldn't, we won't get that bit. People will go, oh, fuck, this guy's quite smart. He knows what a basilica is. <laughs> That's the great thing about that bit. <laughs> so I'm going to say it one more time, just in case we didn't get that nice and clean, right? <laughs> I was in your basilica. <laughs> Don't laugh, because when you laugh, then the people at home will know that something's happened. 
So just stay nice and calm for this bit, right? I'm going to say, Bazilla, can you keep your mouth shut, please? Wait for the actual gag, right. <clears throat> so, uh... <laughs> Montreal... I've turned Italian now. So, uh... <laughs> hey, what the... Hey, what's the, uh... What's the... What's the deal with your bazooka, huh? I was in your... Right, just right, remember, so... So, so um, I visited your basilica today here in Montreal, and I like churches. I do like churches. Or basilicas. <laughs> I like them, but I don't... I'm not necessarily fond about what goes on in them, you know? I used to... When I was a kid, I used to love going to church. I used to love it. I used to love singing hymns. Oh, the church hymns. Weren't they great? Oh, except the only, I loved the music. I wasn't so wild about the lyrics. The lyrics were always the same, weren't they? That God is great. Oh, he's brilliant, that guy. And we're all shit. <laughs> yeah, he's saying, oh, God is great and we are shit. <laughs> God is great and we are shit. And God is great and we are shit. <laughs> What's going on here? I never... <laughs> that was the other thing, wasn't it? There was no, there was no synchronicity between the music and the lyrics. Do you remember you'd get to the end of a, the end of the verse, the last verse, and there'd be one bit of organ, and you go, shit, I've got twelve words to fit into that. <laughs> you don't know where you left it. You just got to the end. He came down from heaven to earth, saves all creatures, and rainbows here. <laughs> organ players loving it. Uh, I can hold it, mate, but I can't change it. Sorry. <laughs> Sometimes it was the opposite problem. Remember when you had just one word and a huge big bit of organ? Oh, that was... And he came down from heaven. <laughs> organ players loving it. You know what used to be my favourite? Christmas carols. Remember Christmas carols? They were great when you sang them in school. Away in a manger. That was my favourite Christmas carol. Away in yeah, nah. But it was a difficult one, away in a manger, because if you started too high on the first line, eh, you had nowhere to go, did you? <laughs> the teacher on the piano, right, ready? And everyone after three, one, two, three, and you go, Away in a manger, no Christmas. <laughs> And you dogs in nearby parks. Huh? Huh? <laughs> and the teacher goes, that was embarrassing. That was, and, you, and, you, and, you, and you'd go, right, look, I'm going to slip down for the next bit. I'm going to overcompensate. So you go, the little lodgy. But you forgot it went down again, didn't it, after that? It went down an octave and you were in even more trouble. Remember that? The little Lord Jesus lay down 